Hi, if you are new here, I'm Kanitsi, and if you're already watching this channel, welcome back. Today we are going to watch episode 37 of Anime Monster, so let's see what happens. Let's go! The preview for the next episode contains spoilers. Be prepared to suffer the consequences of disregarding this notice. We know you'll disregard it anyway. Okay, I hope they mean the preview for like 38th episode. I usually don't watch the previews. I'm pretty sure they don't mean the scene before the opening. Okay, that's like all the scenes from the end of the previous episode, as usual. Okay. Yeah, so... <laughs> as I thought, like, everyone is going there. Yeah, and I think that's very interesting that Lungi actually, I think, um, he is right that Johan is targeting Schuvelt, obviously. Actual Johan. But he thinks that Johan and Tenma is like the same person. But when he like thinks that he he is Johan, he tries to understand him. He actually understands, I think, the actual Johan, like liking chaos and maybe targeting Shuval. And yeah, probably Nina is going to come there too after seeing the book, maybe. And I think in Lotus eyes so far, Johan has to be just like a nice guy, so she's concerned for him. And like, why did he uh, lose his consciousness when he saw this book? What's wrong? Like, wait, we can see the name of the book though. I think that's like monster who was looking for its name, a nameless monster. Okay. Yeah, that's all the scenes. And that's from the hospital. Probably uh, before they ran away. But looks like they ran away together. That's really strange also because she's, she was so bent like on killing him. Uh, even walking through the corridor saying kill him. But then he takes her with him and she goes and he drops her off uh, at this uh, house because that's how the story went so that's a bit peculiar how why i guess her feelings are complicated because she loves her brother and at the same time she knows he's dangerous like even when she was small uh she went through these corridors in the hospital saying kill him but then she willingly went with him and didn't try to like kill him actually um and uh, then when she remembered everything now she does want to get to save the world from this person but at the same time uh she still has some sibling feelings because he's uh, her brother. So just like Tenma, she's unsure if she actually can, can she actually kill Johan? Uh, because for her, it's like, well, she's also a kind person like Tenma, so she doesn't want to kill anyone. Uh, but also, like, it's not, um, like, it's, it's her sibling. So, of course, this is different. Okay. Uh, the opening flew by really fast. There were no spoilers before the opening, so uh, pretty sure that was like the actual preview. Okay, once upon a time. Yeah, that's exactly the monster from the ending. But I think they were shown like two monsters. Um, in the ending. Oh. 
interesting. That's when he like ate him like in the ending. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I remember this. So he became a monster. Oh. And then he like kind of ran through people. He then became like so you become Maybe that's how Johan goes from family to family, but he can't stay, so he eats them, so to say, he kills them. Also, like, becoming a monster destroys you from the inside. But he's going to become hungry. So he liked his life, so he didn't want to eat the boy, but he ate everyone around him. So this boy is like Jochen, I think, in this book, eating everyone around him. Um, Oh, okay, that's interesting. Hmm, maybe he even take the name, he took the name from here. Okay, that's, that's very interesting, I think. Um, we can draw a lot of speculations from this book. And the fact that Anna Nina also don't doesn't have like a specific name. She was Anna when she was small, then she was given the name Nina. 
But for how? Hmm. See, like she's also like a nameless in a way. But maybe she is like that uh, monster that went west, right? Wait. <laughs> the monster that said she didn't need a name. I guess you have good intuition. Okay, that's... Yeah, she is going to go there. And with the same intentions as Tenma. He looks so indifferent. If we assume that Tenma does shoot, would he really miss so much that he would hit Shuvald? And that would be so bad for his character. No, I don't think this could ever happen. And I don't think Jochen will die so early on. Yeah, he can't bring himself to do it. Yeah, that was terrible. He remembers everything. Oh, Mr. Maurer was his name. Man. I actually remembered it. I think that was really terrible, that scene. He remembers everything terrible that he did to pump himself up to make this shot. Well, Johan probably knows. Yeah, he is going to look. Whoa, his face is so scary. Yeah, he knows like exactly where he is. Because you can see the light flickering. Oh. So that was the plan to just like stop him from doing it, take it away from him and shoot Schubert. Yeah, 
And everyone will think that Tenma did it. <gasps> because Johan was like telling everyone that Tenma will be after him and Lungi thinks that Tenma is after sh Damn! Yeah, probably that's what's going to happen. And then I'm pretty sure she will know it too. Yeah, and I'm pretty sure like it all happens faster than they show us because I think Tenma would try stop him otherwise. Wow, there's also gasoline. Uh, that's the wife of. Wait, I think yes. The one that went to the to Mr. Reichwein. No? Isn't it suspicious that she just walks around with gasoline? She's probably like into the band into the band. But what's making him alone actually crucial to this plan? Maybe. So he could get into his heart. But I think if he wanted to kill him, he would do it anytime he wanted. Maybe he wanted to make it public, but still. I think he was just... He just wanted to make him feel alone for... For the fun of it? To see it through himself. Maybe he's just trying to have some... Oh, okay. He... He did have the time to stop, to try to stop him. And then did some push-ups, he's not super weak. Is this actually what he sees? He's, he's supposed to be blind, so probably that's what he imagines. Yeah, he knows. Well, he already understood that he is after him, but he also like understood what he wants to get from it to create chaos. It looks like he's unconscious now, and oh, not yet. <sighs> but yeah, he was not, unfortunately, strong enough. Uh, looks like the plan is going to go through. Let's see. There's a sign. Because of gasoline, so he wants not only to kill Shuvald, but uh, set the whole place on fire and all the books. All the books! Yeah, I'm sorry, I'm most concerned about the books, not... I mean, that's such a treasure, you can't deny that. I'm sure... I'm sure people will make it out, but books, they will be destroyed forever. 
And I think that's what Schuwald understood too, that the books... He brought his whole collection in here and it's going to be destroyed. And because of what Schuwald announced, everyone will think that it was his plan? <laughs> Maybe not. He didn't know? Hmm, so he doesn't get all the info on the plan. So no shooting, but this. Maybe the plan is that everyone will die to fire, but let's see. Man, he is like a maniac. Completely crazy. But he didn't have the guts to pull a trigger on Johan. I mean, you can also shoot the gun, maybe not to kill, but to incapacitate the person. So maybe Schubert thought Johan was simply after his life and he didn't care. But now... He understood that the plan is different. And I think... Yeah, Johan is enjoying what is going on. The, again, his exploration of human nature, I guess. That's interesting. They are kind of like like the opposites, you know. I would like for him to do it, but I guess that wouldn't work for his character. Okay, that's now self-defense too. That's the end of the episode, then I want to see the next one. But yeah, when he also like pulled the gun and Tenma obviously like intending to kill him, shooting him would be also self-defense, not, not assault. <laughs> uh, so, and as a doctor, you might know like what places you can shoot to incapacitate a person, but maybe not kill them. And also, yeah, I'm looking at the ending now. The book was very interesting, so probably the boy is like Jochen, like Jochen has a monster inside of him and maybe he took this name actually from the book, <clears throat> so he feels like he has a monster inside of him um, and so like I'm not sure because like his intentions of killing everyone does not align I think with what happens to the monster in the book because monster didn't want to destroy himself that's why he destroyed everyone else around him uh, but in Johan's case it's like he just doesn't have feelings for humans so he gets bored of them and they're like ends to him or like I don't know maybe pets in case with his temporary parents uh, so I'm not sure uh, can be really translated from the book from this but that's interesting and since he wants chaos well it's also chaos uh, not just killing children but creating this panic it's been a long time since I've been to the library, but I don't think it would be so hard for them to get away from the fire. I would be more worried about the books. Uh, so that's peculiar. 
the light is so light today okay but that would be it for today i guess um i think i really want to see the continuation in the next episode but also like two monsters here are obviously two nameless monsters two twins johan and anna uh, who then received the name nina uh, so she got a name um but uh, it she obviously is the monster who thinks that it doesn't really matter uh but johan is the one who desperately wants a name by the looks of it so and johan in the end he wants that's a difficult question because um nina wants to shoot him and doesn't look first he said he wanted to get her uh, to be with him but then it looked more like he wanted to get rid of her so like in the book actually the monster got rid of his other half or maybe like ate it and so they became one we can look at it like that so nina is at the risk of becoming a monster too share your thoughts in the comments without spoilers of course that would be it for today thank you for watching and see ya mm -hmm.